Hey guys, it's the Danny off the wall here bringing you some domination on high rise. Um, I'm using the ACR with the grenade launcher, Marathon Pro, Hardline Pro and Commando Pro, but you can probably see that. Now, um, basically, I'm uploading this video to talk about the dreaded Model 1887s. Now, I really don't see why people complain about these so much. I mean, sure, the range is a bit long, but you wouldn't... Sure, the range is a bit long, but... You know, you wouldn't be complaining if it was you that was using them and it got you loads of kills. I mean, it's just people being bitchy about them. I mean, what's wrong with them? They're fun. That's it. I mean, people forget that's what video games are supposed to be about. Fun. It's not meant to be about realism or crap like that. I mean, I say I mean a lot, don't I? It's the... The range of them is probably a bit realistic. I don't know. I've never really used one of the guns. I've never used a gun, to tell you the truth, except from a water pistol and a um, paintball gun. <coughs> or one of the, you know, potato guns that you, like, stick the gun into the, um, into the potato, then it sort of plops out, then you fire it, like, half a metre. Um, yeah, but that's all I really wanted to say about them, because... Just stop bitching. I mean, Infinity Ward are going to patch them soon and then nobody will use them because they'll be crap because they've got a slow rate of fire and all that junk. Uh, I mean, I'm using the um, the M4 shotgun there and I don't know why that guy didn't die after that onslaught of bullets. But, <laughs> he was... Just, I mean, right. I just want to say, everyone, stop bitching. And I'm going to start talking about the game now. Um, this game actually is pretty good considering... Well, it's pretty good for me. Um, I use... I get quite a lot of Predator missiles. I get about three. And I get four care packages. And I've basically got my kill streak layout as... Um, I've got four, five, nine. And that's the care package the Predator Missile and the Pavlo. Now, the Pavlo, I'm actually using in place a Chopper Gunner, which I had before, and that's just because I believe myself that it, you can get more kills using it, and that guy was being a dick, um, being completely oblivious, oblivious to his surroundings, and just being a total cock. Um, the reason I died there was because I didn't use my knife, which I don't really do a lot. I don't knife. Uh, since I've switched to the tactical layout, I've just stopped knifing and I've started crouch shooting, as you saw there. Which is, I recommend crouch shooting because it sort of like confuses the enemy and they think you're dead. And you're not, obviously. <laughs> and you just basically rape their leg. Um. Uh, so I don't really play domination and get like um. Sometimes I play it to capture points and that, but mostly I just play it to for the kills, you know. And I see basically the whole enemy team trying to do that bloody high rise glitch, and nearly all of them fall. I see some of my own team do it as well. They're just being cock faces. Um. I've basically decided that in COD, the only way you're going to win is by playing newishly, which I clearly am. And I'm pretty sure he just spawned there, which was a bit stupid. I mean, earlier on, I had a spawn. I was on high rise as well, and I was in that corridor that's um, just below the helicopter, and we spawned at the exact same time, right next to each other. And he was the guy I'd killed before. Like, he sort of killed me with his knife, and I did the same. But it was a, it was, we killed each other, and I don't know who killed him. I really don't know. But um, that guy was obviously oblivious again. It was here where he spawned, and I spawned just where I was there. Um, yeah, it's host migration. I've said before, but I think it's pretty good. I mean, people get pissed off with it. Like, oh my god, I can't believe, like this is happening, oh, I was like so gonna get a kill there, and um, sorry for that weird voice, but um, you can remember in the old CODs, I mean it was like you were about to get a kill then the game would just end because the host was being a dick face I'm trying to think of like 
different insults for people. And I get another counter UAV, whoop to do. Um, the This team is really bad. I mean, they all just sort of try. I don't see why my grenade launcher didn't hit him there. Um, <coughs> yeah, they're all just trying to, like, go to the same place. And it's just letting us rape them from the front, you know. He was bad as a crowd shot at him. I've not got much more to talk about, really. Um, if you just want to leave in the comments, like, your opinions about the Model 1887s or um, what your kill streak layout is, and that's pretty much it. I would let you enjoy the rest of the match, but unfortunately I forgot to record sound again. But um, I think I must have, have a said. Yeah, I think I must have a record for the amount of care packages in one match. I mean, I get tons. You know, I think I have said this in the exact same way. I've actually recorded this commentary twice by now. And it's just because I basically messed up on the first one, started pronouncing things wrong. Like I, I, I said enemy instead of enemy. I'm not sure if this was this one. They're all, they're both rolling into each other. Um... Yeah, so I've got some tips for high rise. Well, actually I would, but it's really just depends on your luck. Depends what team you're in. If you're in the Spetsnaz, you're bound to win, really. And um, there's obviously that glitch there um, to the left of me, which pretty much everyone knows about, but it's quite hard to pull off. I've never done it. Probably if I practice, probably if I practice at it, I'd be able to do it. Sorry for all like, like um, me aiming and. Did you notice there it didn't come out up that I had a three kill streak, um, yeah. Sorry for all the aiming and, and the pronouncing wrong. I don't know what it is. I've got something in my throat. I've got and, um, what was it? Yeah, um, yeah, and I'm pretty tired. It's about midnight. Well, not midnight, but. Close to, it's about half eleven at night, so that's why I'm slurring my words a little bit. Um, I finally got one of the VGA splatter things, so I can see it on the TV and that. And on the computer, which helped a lot, because I can remember looking at the computer when I was recording this and it was really laggy. And I also got a 42-inch TV in my room. And I know it sounds like I'm bragging, but it bloody helps when you're playing such an advantage. Um, my pay flow that I just got rapes the enemy team, sort of. It doesn't get me more majority of kills, actually. I'm not sure how many it gets me. I didn't check. wasn't really paying attention. If you want, you could do it yourself. Um, I'm on 24 kills now, I think. It's quite hard to tell. Uh, basically, earlier on, I was playing a match on Terminal and I shot through like three of my teammates and got a double kill. It's pretty funny. I mean, they were all just sort of standing there. I'm like, oh my god, do something. But it got me kills and a um, pave low, so I wasn't complaining. Yeah, Hardline Pro, I recommend using. Well, I recommend myself using because I find it hard to get kill streaks. That's why I don't like using Nuke or Chopper Gunner anymore. Well, I never used the Nuke, but um, the Nuke's really annoying, actually. I mean, it's okay if you have it, but being on the same team or being on the enemy team is really annoying because it just ends the game and you can't get any more kills. Um, I suppose if there was a Nuke in real life, that would be the least of your worries, but... Um, that guy gets a bloody Harrier strike. All he gets freaking counter UAVs. <laughs> I get a th three out of the four of my care packages is counter UAVs here. Um, I basically that's coming near the end of the match. So rate, comment, subscribe, and enjoy. So, um, comments about the model eighteen eighty sevens and kill streaks, and bye.